Today we're looking at the Saddleback Medium ID Wallet. It's another 100 year warranty beauty from the Saddleback Leather family. So thanks for visiting Wallatopia. Go to wallatopia.info, register for videos, emails we send you, other discounts uh, for manufacturers and so forth. And remember, this is a no BS review on wallet phones on this channel. Don't forget to subscribe by the link below. And remember, we purchase all the wallets we review. If someone does a review and they received it in, uh, for free in exchange for a fair review, it's still biased, so be wary. Now today, as mentioned, we are getting into the Saddleback Medium ID wallet. So let's get into it. We have plastic. And so let's get into the wallet itself. This is a tobacco color. And uh, it is a, see that? All leather will do that. But uh, this is a wax treatment on here. And if we look at it, it's really interesting. And they stand by their, their products, 100 year warranty. And so let's see what uh, we've got by way of sewing on this and leather. Looks really good. Saddleback uh, Leather Company products are always excellent. You can tell we have multiple layers of leather in here. They don't do any edge treatments like you'd normally see. Let me get this out of here. Get a nice close up of this. They use pigskin. Is a liner which is some argue stronger than even cowhide nice looking wallet now onto the feature review of the saddleback leather medium id wallet with the medium id wallet there are no features on the exterior we move immediately to the interior on the left hand side we see we have one two three card slots here as well as a rear interior card slot behind that which gives you great capacity on the right hand side we have an ID slot. Uh, one thing I like about the uh, Saddleback Leather products is they have no plastic. This just goes all the way through here. And the reason why is because plastic or mesh, that'll wear out way before the, wall, uh, the leather will. And so they choose not to do that, which is fine. And then behind it, there is also one more card slot. And then behind all of this, a rear card slot as well. So you have plenty of capacity there for different cards. And then on the interior, we have a billfold pocket. There's one, and it is uh, nice in length, and will provide access uh, for, for taking care of all kinds of currencies. And that is a quick review of the features of the Saddleback Leather Medium ID Wallet. Now on to the card and cash insertion test. Now you see we got uh, six cards in here, uh, plus eight slips of cash, that's pretty good. Minimalist carry on this I'd say would be about four cards, uh, reasonable is about six. Um, and you know, as it stretches out you will, you will be able to get more in here. Now the company makes no recommendations for card or cash. From a quality perspective this is designed in the United States and manufactured in Mexico. Yahoo! Yeah, <clears throat> yeah, exactly, cowboy country. Um, now it has, it has a a great leather smell to it. I mean, this this really has all kinds of uh, quality to it by way of what's in it. And if we look at the uh, leather on this, we can see that it has multiple layers. And this multiple layers in incorporates, of course, the the uh, cow skin that's in there, as well as the pig skin that you see. And the pig skin is the liner in there. And so there is a lot of leather that's uh, been put into this particular wallet. Now this rougher quality leather provides greater water resistance than leather split more and it is a wax based uh, versus a dye based implementation this tobacco color in particular is that it is priced at and it needs to be broken in each of these slots fit one card nicely as I really put them in there but it can stretch to accommodate more and it will develop a wonderful patina over time now the measurements on this is 4.4 by 3.4 by 0.6 inches and it weighs 
90 grams. That's right, you heard that, 90 grams. This is a hefty wallet. Now Saddleback Leather has a unique feel uh, to the company and the owner Dave is just as unique. He wandered into this business and pretty much decides what he wants to do based on everything except chasing money, fame, or glory. His company makes uh, really long-lasting, durable products, and this 100-year warranty is easy to see because of the feel of this product, the way it's built, and they have no problem backing that up. So now let's get into the final score. For quality of four, price of three, features of three, usability of three, and perception of four. That gives you a final score of 35 out of 50. If you want to see all the rankings for the wallets we've re reviewed, go to walletopia.info slash rankings. That's it. And you can see it in the link up here as well. And if you have wallets you'd like us to review, let us know in the comments below and we'll get them and put them on the channel. Thanks for watching. Bye.